Assalamu alaikum and dobry vecher everyone. I went online to uh, chatislam.com today, in fact a couple of times today, but uh, when the morning class got done with uh, Mutahir Sabri, I decided that, you know, I think I'll ask this certain room monitor a question that I'm sure she would be able to answer because I seriously doubt that uh, Mutahir Sabri would be able to uh, figure this one out. But uh, my question to, was, how would you clean a beaded, embroidered abaya that has uh, a little bit of dirt on it? It's an al Qadaram abaya, which I really love. It's a, a burgundy one, and on the bottom it's got beads and uh, embroidery and uh, and uh, little uh, crystal things on it. You know, some pretty good blade. But I wore it to the, the masjid on Friday for a Juma prayer. But because there's so much dirty snow, it had been melting. And when I walked from the bus stop to the masjid, you know, it just got dirtier so I wanted to know how to clean it without really messing it up. So today I thought, well, I'm going to give it a shot. And uh, the monitor said, uh, put some shampoo into a bucket or bowl or some big basin that you could dip something in. And uh, then put water in it and just kind of swirl it around so you get some suds. So I did that. And then I hung the abaya on, believe it or not, a knob that's on a cabinet above my toilet in the bathroom so I wouldn't have to try to hold the hanger up because I wanted to keep it on the hanger. So then I just took the, the hem of it and just dipped it in the bucket, which I had sitting in my bathroom sink. So I dipped it a few times and then uh, I rinsed the shampoo out and then I just hung it in the tub to dry pretty much and then after you know I did that this morning and then uh, this afternoon after I got back from uh, the doctor's office you know I, I looked at it and it was mostly dry but I left it hanging in the bathroom for a while and then a few hours ago I took it out and hung it on this bar that's in my uh, living room right near the door which some people in my family call a chin up bar but I use it for when I'm hanging up shirts or abayas or skirts or dresses or anything like that I'll hang them up there after I put the things on the hanger and then just gather them all up and put them in their uh, respective spots in the closets so anyway I just hung it up there and then I looked at it later and all the dirt was gone so uh, it's a tip I'm sure you could use woolite too but uh, she said uh, just shampoo so uh, so that's a tip for you if you have something uh, that's delicate like beading and embroidery that you just want to spot clean just dip it in a mixture of shampoo or uh, woolite and water and then rinse it out thoroughly and then hang it to dry and uh, a while later you're good to go. So uh, that's a tip for today so uh, <laughs> you never know what you'll learn on chatislam.com. <laughs> well I'll come back with something else and uh, assalamu alaikum, dovidzenya and miao sirmila.